guys, it's Sarah. A uh, long time no see. I'm so sorry for being gone for two whole weeks. Like, I can't believe it. Like, that's crazy. Um, I didn't mean for that to happen. It's just, like, kind of what happened. Um, I was busy. I had some family in town. And then I was sick for, like, the last, like, week. And I, uh, I don't want to go into details about it. It would just know that it was horrible, but I am better now. And I can actually put, like, makeup on and not look, like, too bad. So, yeah. Sorry about this whole situation. Um, the background. I have my package stuff over here for my giveaway. Um, Pretty Pistol 86 won. So I'm really happy about that. Um, thank you guys for entering. There will be another giveaway probably at the end of summer. Um, and the lighting's really bad. I just don't like the setup in the office anymore because it doesn't feel like the office anymore and I'm having like a real hard time like coming to grips with like I'm leaving this house and I'm moving so we're sitting in the living room on the floor in front of the couch. Hey. Alright, but anyways enough of that stuff. Um, let's get on to my Pan That Palette update. It's probably going to be pretty disappointing because this last month I seriously wore makeup maybe five or six times. And I'm not exaggerating like five or six times. I just was busy, was on a road trip, was in Ohio, like didn't really have time. Then my family came to visit and we... Only I only wore makeup like I think one time that entire time because my sister told me that I put too much stuff on and it takes too long but pfft, whatever and then I was sick so I didn't have I just didn't wear makeup so I didn't meet um, all my goals yeah. I did. I'm still panning the Too Faced Would Do Our Eyes palette um, pan that palette actually was started by Amber F if you guys haven't heard of her I will link her channel down below um, so that way you guys can check her out. She is amazing. Um, I really enjoy watching her and all the tips and tricks that she has. But anyways, on to the shadows. Um, this is what it looks like. Uh, again, it's not that impressive. I haven't made that much progress. Again, because I haven't used it. But I did hit pan on fuzzy handcuffs. I hit pan on fuzzy handcuffs right after my last update and then today I hit pan on garter belt when I was getting ready because I since I have darker hair now um I actually have been using it to fill in my eyebrows you can't really tell like with the lighting um but I really like it I thought that it was just like gray from looking at it like in the pan and I've used it on my eye and everything but let me see if I can give you like a swatch it's actually like a brownish color. But yeah, so um, I wore um, In the Buff again, still. Why am I all over the place? Oh, because I haven't filmed in two weeks. That's why. <sighs> okay. I've worn In the Buff. Um, un I use it to set my under eye concealer still. Um, satin sheets. I'm kind of getting a dent in that. I don't know if you can tell. Um, but there is a little, like, dip over here on, like, the left-hand side. If you're looking at it this way, there's getting to be a little bit of dip in there. Um, the couple times I wore eyeshadow, um, half the time I just put it, like, a big blending brush and just put it, like, all over my lid. And then I do use this as a face highlight. So that's the highlight got going on right now. It works great as a face highlight. I actually really, really like it. Um, didn't use birthday suit. Uh, fuzzy handcuffs I used every time I did it. I did my makeup because I use it to blend out the crease. Um, sugar walls is what I have on my eyes right now. But you can't tell because the lighting is crappy. But I'm getting closer and closer to the pan there. Um, lap dance I did wear one time. I needed like a really quick like swipe of something. I forget what it was for, but I seriously just stuck my finger in it and wiped it on my eyelids, put mascara on, and like I was out the door. Um, didn't use um, Voulous Vo uh, garter belt. Like I said, I have used, I used that a couple times like on my eye, and then I've been using it to fill in my brows. And then I did use French Tickler one time. I was practicing eyeliner. 
um, and you can see that there's a little bit of a dent, dent in there. So my goals that I had set for March were to hit pan on every shadow except for French Tickler and just get a bigger like dip in that. Um, so I, out of the six shadows that I wanted to hit pan on, I only hit pan on two. So I mean, I made a third of my goal and French Tickler has a little bit um, deeper of a hole. So that makes me happy, but I'm... I'm kind of disappointed, but I can't be disappointed at the same time because I didn't wear makeup. Like you can't, ex I can't expect there to be crazy progress when I'm not wearing makeup. So there's that. I will of course insert a picture of what it looks like so you guys can see because this this doesn't help. But I'm still really liking it. I'm glad that I kind of took a break from wearing makeup and using it because I think if I would have kept like full force with using this like every single day um I think I probably would have gotten burnt out because at, towards the end of February I was getting a little burnt on this but still gorgeous still love it still glad I decided to use it um yeah that's pretty much all I have to say about it I will insert a comparison picture from uh last month to this month I'm not I'm kind of interested myself to see what kind of progress I've made and yeah my goals for next month uh well for April are going to be the same that I had last month I want to hit pan on satin sheets uh lap sugar walls lap dance blues bow, and then I want to get a bigger dip on French tickler so those are my goals hopefully I can do it um and then of course to grow the pan on everything else that I have. So four pans are showing out of nine, which is pretty good. I'm actually happy with that. So yeah, that's all. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about the palette or like the challenge or anything, um, feel free to leave that down below. And I look forward to seeing you guys in my next video. Bye.